Welcome to Creative Madness. How's it going, YouTube Nation? It's the homie Game Guru. You know, as an 80s kid, someone who really loves the 80s and grew up with all the great cartoons back then. I've done the Thundercat Sword and many other props from classic cartoons, but the one I haven't touched yet is He-Man. And I thought, you know what, the time has come to do the classic He-Man Sword. I'm not talking about the new one, the classic sword. So I'm going to show you guys how I made this by the Power Gray Skull. I'm going to show you how to make the classic He-Man Sword. To start off, use Google to find a good image of the sword. Blow it up to around 32 inches in length and proportional width. Then split it into two 11 by 17 images to be printed out. Print the two 11 by 17 copies. You will trim the edge of each and fit together like this. Tape together and cut out. Also cut out two small slits on the sides and the center portion out. Trace onto cardboard and use a cutting blade to carefully cut around each side of the sword. Do the same for the handles and the center pieces. Once all pieces are cut out, use glue to stick the pieces together. Once glued together, this is what you get. Outdoors, use metallic silver spray paint on both sides of the entire sword. And there you have it, the completed He-Man sword, ready for use. From printed image to the completed sword. So there you have it, my He-Man sword design. I hope you guys like it. Now I know for a lot of you out there who have watched my channel, you realize that I've done a lot of cardboard swords. I really enjoy making them. I also know that many of you, you don't have the time or the resources to commit to making a sword yourself. You know, I use very strong glue. I have a huge supply of cardboard so I can make a lot of this stuff. So what I decided to do is that I'm going forward with my own Etsy shop. Many of you have heard of Etsy.com and I'm putting a lot of these cardboard swords on there. An example of some of the ones I have on there, including the He-Man sword that will be on there soon, but I also made the classic Thundercats sort of omens, where you know we all love Thundercats, and I made this one. Plus I have a whole bunch of unfinished swords. I just made a whole bunch of prototypes and I just have them lying around. And it just makes sense to do something with all these sword prototypes that I have around the place for comic book conventions, for cosplay, for steampunk, for Halloween, for birthdays, whatever. I also have my own battle axe design. Again, something I was going to do something with, but I ended up not doing it. But still have a bunch of battle axes lying around. So these are going to be on my Etsy site. Check it out, see what you think. And if you have any suggestions, I'm open to it because I'm going to make even more weapons, including steampunk weapons. I've been introduced to the whole idea of steampunk and I love the intricacies of their weapons and just the multiple layers are involved. So I'm I'm uh, looking forward to coming out with that design and showing you guys and seeing what you think. So I'm the Homie Game Guru. Thanks for watching. And more Creative Madness is coming in the months and days ahead. Take care, everyone. See you.